One of the largest uh, areas of need in the whole field of thoracic oncology uh, is a uh, specific treatment, a targeted treatment for KRAS mutant cancers. KRAS mutant cancers are the most common uh, type of molecular abnormality driver oncogene uh, in all of lung adenocarcinoma and probably in all of lung cancer. Uh, and we have tried very hard over decades to come up with drugs that can specifically target uh, KRAS as an oncogenic driver, but have been unsuccessful. So to have uh, any agent that has uh, the uh, appearance of benefit against uh, KRAS mutant lung cancer is a huge in development. Uh, also within the KRAS mutant cancers, the most common mutation in KRAS mutant cancers is the G12C mutation, G12C. Uh, and uh, this agent, the AMG510, is the uh, a drug that specifically targets KRAS mutant uh, lung cancers that have that G12C target. So it targets KRAS and it targets the specific mutation so I know a lot of people might say, well, it's a rare mutation and it's a rare subtype of that. Well, it's actually not. There are as many KRAS G12C mutations as there are EGFR mutations in exon 19, maybe even more. So it's a very, very important uh, development. Uh, in recent years, many uh, investigators uh, have uh, developed drugs that target KRAS G12C, uh, and now we are seeing them move into the clinic uh, and we are seeing uh, really unexpected and unprecedented benefit. Uh, this uh, drug was discussed at the ASCO meeting, uh, American Society of Clinical Oncology meeting in June of 2019, and the early results of its success and, and frankly lack of significant toxicity were presented. So we are very uh, excited about the presentation of more data uh, about uh, AMG uh, 510, also, uh, other uh, specific RAS-targeted drugs that are in development as well. So this is a, a huge development for the field of oncology. Uh, it's a, a dream come true, actually, for oncologists that have worked in the precision medicine area. Uh, and we are just so happy to have it there, uh, to have it uh, continue to show good results in testing and to be able to hear more about it uh, in these upcoming meetings.